Hello and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem Lonely Mirror, a Fire Emblem 8 ROM hack by Caladrius. I'm your host, Pondon, and we're about to start Chapter 9, Winter Melt. Lord Devante. The Amatonian forces are outside the castle gate. We're ambushed at the shrine. The shrine. Should be the shrine. Must have failed. All those shine tones failed. Must protect the heart. Oh, Prince Caden, I didn't see you there. Calm yourself, Rain. You've done well. Prince Caden and I have been discussing this very thing. It seems my brother's a traitor to our beloved country. This whole time, he's been working with the enemy. Yes, it seems that Prince Joseph could have been poisoning our king and a scheme to usurp the throne. I will take the battlefield to end my brother's life. This is a family matter. Excellent idea, my lord. I will gather my strongest to prepare for battle. So Caden is evil. Okay, so that was that was a good read by me. That made that last scene just makes so much more sense if Caden's on the bad guy side. I'm curious if Caden will like turn around though. I feel like I could see him doing that. Like he's a double agent of sorts. It seems our fears were all for nothing. Prince Caden can still be useful to us. Yes, but the best outcome is the two brothers kill each other and we get Princess Leah in our custody. <laughs> Looks like it can still come out on top. I will take on the battlefield to ensure that we do. And my family reign. Have I ever? After the day, the proclaimers may also recover Celsius' bell. Can't run away forever, my dear sister. Huh? Whoa, what happened to her? Interesting mug here. Devante the Enforcer. Queenie the Watcher. It's been a while. Indeed, now can, where can we talk? Ooh, we got more snow maps here, boys. Split paths. Prince Caden. I've spotted Amatonin's forces. Prince Joseph is among the group as you expected. I should proceed, my lord. Shall I ready the ballista just to be safe? Yes, but hold your positions. I must first speak with my brother. We will first ensure that Amaton is no longer an enemy of Celeste. You still have your doubts about Devante, don't you? You must be hatching some kind of plan. It's a little something that my brother and I came up with. We want to make sure that Devante believes that he has the upper hand in this battle. And why on earth does that matter? At your command, I'll just beat Devante to a pulp. Patience, Helga. Helga! <laughs> If we don't play our cards right, Devante will flee and this will be all for nothing, I'm afraid. Yeah, stupid. Devante may know how to restore the king. Wanna go, Archer boy? I have notions of that, it should only take one shot. That is, you all wait for my command. For now, hold your positions. Gotta look. Is she a wyvern than Telga? That's really funny, if that's the case. It's quiet. But I can feel the tension in the air. They have prepared to fight. Uh, for those not, no, the project I'm working on has a wyvern lord than Helga. Caden knows the proclaimers have infiltrated our ranks, but also doesn't know whether to trust Amatona. I guess it's a bit of a double-edged sword on who to trust. And here I thought we were finally understand each other. No matter how you see it, our actions appear aggressive towards Celeste. How do we proceed if we are able to tell friend from foe here? I can at least to an extent... I sense a strong aura focused in the direction of Prince Joseph pointed earlier. Simple enough, then. The proclaimers are protecting the castle. Can we cut a path through and avoid Celeste altogether? No. This requires finesse. Celeste will surely attack if we target the castle directly. Fine, then what do you propose? We head south. Once I speak with my brother, the battle will shift in our favor. Have it your way, then. Prepare for battle, everyone. Alright, so something, something's going on that we're not privy to. I'm just give me one sec. All right, season the gate. We have 11, wow, okay. Oh yes, this looks like a map I can get behind. So we have two paths. We've got Rain, the male with Sonic, Sonic Sword, Peg Knight, look at that. Look at the stats on this guy. Look at that defense, stocky lad. And we got Proclaimer on the castle. And what's going on down here? Proclaimer, proclaimer. Helga. Helga the peg. Helga the peg. This looks she looks worse than Faith. But I think she has better weapon ranks than Faith, right? Yeah, she's better weapon ranks than Faith. Rob. Well, he looks like he's our Grant replacement. Javelin. Actually he doesn't look as good as Grant. We could use both of them. Let's see. Celeste, Celeste. Caden. Whoa, look at Caden. Level 16. Look at him go. Alright. Royal Bow. Caden only can strike second. It's a personal Brave Bow and a Blue Gem. Benji. 
This game gives you a ton of bow users. Oh no. The faded one too short bow. Um, Alright, so there's Benji and there's Caden. Okay. Alright, so I gotta think how I want to approach this. I think we're sending Winnie over this way. I can't, maybe is, is this where we bring in Liang? We bring in Ma Liang. Because um, Atticus isn't going to do too much here. But let's just double check and see if there's anything to steal. Uh, there's a vulnerary. No stealables. Besides what's on Caden. But I don't think Atticus has enough speed to do that. No, he doesn't. So, and Liang doesn't either. Because Liang's kind of slow. Yeah, Liang has 10 speed, which is really low for like a Thief character. Um, at that level, at least, I feel. Especially compared to Atticus. But, um, so we're going to bench Addy. I think we're going to bring Whale. To get some extra healing up in here. So we're going to take our heal staff. We'll give her a light tome because she can actually use them. Okay, and then take a vulnerary. Is there anything else that I can take for you? Iron bow, shining bow? I don't really need two iron bows here. Shining bow might be useful. Um, don't need the antitoxin. Do I have any other lances? Horse slayer. Do I need the horse slayer here? Uh, horse slayer could be good if I send Grant down low. I kind of thinking Joseph needs to go down. That's like the one thing. Because we got Celeste down low and the Proclaimers up high. My gut is I want to split my forces, man. You know that's what I'm thinking. So we're going to send Boone. Boone goes this way. Faith goes down. Brett will send down as well. Miles. Miles just isn't very good here. I think Caspian might be a better choice. But his stats just aren't very good. Oh, do I have a Lance Reaver now? Let me double check that. I do have a Lance Reaver. So Miles became way better. Pretty immediately. Okay. And you have the Maestra, Killing Edge, Steel Sword, Slim Sword. You can ditch the Slim Sword. Just take like... Iron Sword, I guess, instead. Because neither of these guys use blades particularly well. We'll ditch this. I guess this is about as good as we're going to get it. I definitely need to go shopping. Yeah, so we can send Miles over this way then. So Miles will go, so we'll send Miles... Lail, Miles, Brett, Boone, and Winnie over this way, I think. And then these go down. Uh, Leah this way. No, Leah should, Leah should go in the group, because Leah's buff. Like, this is definitely the buffer group. Uh, yeah, this is definitely, like, Axe Bros Paradise. I think Caspian would be really strong here. But his stats just, like, don't hold up. 10, 6, 7. When he's, when he's probably getting benched after this, unfortunately. Uh, I mean, his stats aren't... This would be a good trip place to train him, I guess. But I don't really think... It's going to make that much of a difference. And having the archer is going to be more valuable. Alright, so let's try this out. Winter melts. Let's see how this goes. More if he six music. I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay. So we're gonna put Grant here.
The Verge. Kill the Proclaimers. So I wonder if this is one of those chapters where it's like, don't fight the Celeste dudes if you can help it. Or if the Celeste dudes just will like let you walk right in. Faith can take care of these guys, I think. Because these are both sword dudes, right? Steel sword, iron sword. Okay, Faith should be fine there. Okay. Prince Joseph goes down. Catherine goes down. And then, yeah, we'll send the rest over this way. So let's stay in range on turn one. So what are these guys saying? Steel sword, iron sword, iron sword. So 12, 12, 15. So that's 14, 11, 11. Which is 25, 36 damage, minus 27. Nine times three. So yeah, you're fine. I didn't need to do that. Uh, so let's um, just gonna move these guys in slowly. I guess I can do this. Alright, let's see how this works. Look at the tanks from Verge here. The Verge, man! Oh man, I wish I was getting more experience for these kills. One-shotting, though. One-range short bows, man. When he does take an absolute beating, though. If the ballista hits, she's dead. So it was my fault for trying to trade off the javelin. We'll see what happens. So these guys all just go for her. Okay, yeah, so that was dumb. Uh, but now we know. Now we know. So what I don't love about the start, I'm not just saying this because I died, like that was a very avoidable death. Like I wanted to, I misread something. So let's do this instead. Okay, so let's do missions off. I wanted to change my item here and that's like the only reason I moved Winnie so far in. Okay, Winnie, Whale, Brett, Fire Tone, Liam, and then Converge. Faith with the Keeper on the Slim Lance Grind, Prince Joseph. He wanted to call him Chief Joseph of the Nez Perce. Alright, Verge. Gets that axe rank though. Okay, Brett. Okay, so it goes as planned. Okay. Yeah, what I don't like about this first turn is that it's just like wait for the enemies to come attack you. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops, there we go. Okay, thanks, Joseph. Man, I forgot how small that map was. Whoops. That's a good level up, I'll take it. Good job, Faith. <laughs> Great job, Block. Great job, Plug in the Lane. Alright, let's see. What are you saying here? Yeah, Faith can just get this guy out of here. Whoops. Totally misreading situations.
can do some thinking. You need to. Let's, you can get this. Oop, nope. Oop, accidentally clicked off my screen. Here we go. Oh, I'm getting cursor drift. Hang on. I don't know why this happens sometimes. I think I might just be on my keyboard. No, I'm not restarting. Oops. Resume. Alright, so now. Let's see, I can get this. And then can I get this? Yes! Alright, so we're safe. It's an honor that you came here personally, Queenie. It's rare that we have the Harbringers. The Harbingers 5 get such an opportunity. It sounds like a band. I guess that's the theme of the music. Enough of the formalities. You know I can't stand that crap. That's why you haven't come. It's over, Devante. You lost. No, you must be mistaken. This is our opportunity to recover Celsius Bell and get a lead on Lita's flute. Now, I've been observing the situation. If things continue, Prince Kate and Joseph will have you cornered with nowhere to run. You'll be dead and the harp lost. Your instincts have never been wrong. Then we must leave at once. Rain will cover our escape. Understood. I'll be sure to leave the cleansed behind as a surprise. Do what you want. I don't care. What about him? Well, let's just say it's a bit of a personal project of mine. Whatever. Let's just go. We make for Berga. After many years of waiting, Ubeer's drums are finally within our grasp. I'll give you the details on the way. Rain! I must head out. Something has come up. I understand. I'll finish things up here and follow your trail. Looks like the Amatona force targeted the castle. Mm -hmm. This could be bad then. Tell everyone to intercept the Amatona. Finally, some action. Oh, what? Because I so because I killed the Ballista dude. So I'm basically punished for going up this way. But I guess we'll see what happens. I mean, I'm gonna continue, I'm gonna play on. But as it stands, I feel like I'm being punished. Can we horse slayer? I didn't bring the horse slayer, did I? No. Whoops. Teeing this up for Grant. It's like, look, I have some guys coming down here, too. Well, there's a bit of healing. Boop. Okay. Fire bark. Okay. Answer in the sky. Yep. Let's go, Miles. All right, we're charging. More ballista. Okay. So I wonder if that like happens regardless. But this is this became super interesting right now though with all these dudes charging in. Fire hell over here. All right. It's like so. I thought so. I heard you liked ballista. All right. Um, oh boy. Okay. Uh, let's see. I don't want to kill any of these guys. You survive. I think the play is just gonna be to chill here and let them come to me. Where's Helga at? Did Helga go up? Yeah, she did. I gotta be careful, I don't wanna kill Helga. Alright, we're peeling you back. We're going to get into defensive positions here. Lance Reaver in the forest should be fine. In the house. Don't forget the Milarepa. Strong its axes and cavalry. I think these guys all have lances. Lance, 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 lance. I could use the Milarepa. But I also don't want to take maximum damage when do that. Uh, 
iron bow. Okay, let's end it here. And everyone wants to just chill. Just keep it cool, man. Just keep it cool. Let's see what happens here. I was not expecting everyone to charge right now, but let's see if this matters. Let's see how strong my enemy phase game will be right now. Power, skill, luck, HP, okay. These guys keep charging in. Okay, takes the tanks. Let's break a javelins on Grant. Caden. Just whittling him down. I wonder if Winifred's gonna die now. When he dies, we'll see what happens. Oh, he doesn't attack. That's super interesting. All right. Well, that was weird. I guess like he would have died on the counter, maybe. Helga's almost dead. Let's see, would you have died? No, you could have easily killed me. You had two shots, dude. Uh, all right. Well, let's do this. Joseph, Gap, what's the word? What the hell's going on? I should ask you, Kane. You've been playing double agent. Oh, all right. That's a long and slightly painful story. Then is Amazon of the enemy? Shockingly, no. Princess Leah understands the situation is offering support. And her suspicions about Devante were, yep, he's taken Betty's harp and used some twisted song to warp father's mind. He is part of some ancient cult called the Proclaimers who have infiltrated the castle and started this war, basically in an attempt to destroy the world. Blast, damn it. I hate that I know you aren't lying. Well, then you must know what comes next. Yep, let's change the tide of this battle, shall we? More like a massacre if they stand a chance. Those little to Celeste Royal Family, heed my order. Stand down. Do not engage Amatona. Those who will not comply will be subject to execution. So... Dang, okay. So I got some green units. Helga's is totally screwed, though. Uh, let's see what we can do here. We might not be in as bad of shape as I thought. Why oh, can't I recruit these guys, though? Faith is so good. Let's see. Let's just keep moving them. Rescue dropping someone up there would be pretty nifty, but let's see how we can make this work. I really hope I don't get punished if Helga dies here, because I want her killer lance. And let's see. Okay, we can do that. He's the scariest one, though. Speed though. 33. Why is this guy so good? Why is he just so insanely strong? I really don't have a chance. Uh, he doubles like all of my dudes. Even my bow guy, I can't really do that much to him. 71. I can get him down to 16. basically need to do 16 damage to him, which is doable. Oof. Oof, the damage though. I mean, all right, I gotta think this one through, boys. Uh, there's nothing to do down here, so I gotta figure this out. So let's lean in a bit. All right, sitting up. Now, Brett. Brett's probably a good choice for some chip. Fifty-one hit rate to do twenty damage. And you're toast. Mm. I mean, you're basically 
I mean, your hit rate's... It's like a dodgy enough hit rate, man, where I don't even want to mess with it. I guess we should try this first. Because it all kind of hinges on this anyway. Conscious and Kins means nothing to me. But I'll have pleasure in this. Nope. Okay, yeah, I figured as much. So, heal. Yeah, I don't think there's any way I can kill him this turn. He's just too buff. Like, he shouldn't have this much defense, in my opinion. Like, it's good that he's that he's crazy. Like, he's just really buff at this point in the game. Like, if he didn't have as much... He should have less speed. Like, no one's even close to being, like, able to handle him. Leah's the only one with, like, even remotely that's similar of speed. Yeah, I feel like this is a little bit of like, I gotta burn the RNs here. Okay, crit? Nope. Oops. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna end well. They can't both hit, right, at 38? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I'm so screwed. Yeah, there was really nothing I could do there. I could have just tried waiting, I guess, but... What's the fun in that? Um... If I get two crits, 12-12, I can beat him, so let's try this. Nope. I, that's right, he's doubling me. Okay, let's see what happens. Helga, no. Okay. Yeah, okay, I figured as much. And I get a game over, too, for that. Man, that's annoying. Yeah, that boss is just buff, man. He's just really buff. Like, I don't really have any good options against him. Like, I shouldn't have to rely on a 51 hit to do, like, decent damage. But... We'll see. Alright. It was worth a try. We're gonna try this again in a bit, but... Thanks again for watching, guys. This is Lonely Mirror, ROM hack by Caladrius of Fire Emblem 8. And... That was chapter 9. We're gonna try again in just a bit to see if we can defeat Rain. Um, I am curious though, like, if I sent all of my units down, what that does instead. And I guess, like, Caden would be, like, probably the best fit for him anyway, so it seems like the game, like, gives me the option to go to the right and down, but then it just punishes me for splitting. Like, I don't know, I feel like with splitting up your units or giving people options to split up your units, you should always make it rewarding, but challenging, like... Yeah, that's just kind of how I how I feel about that. It should be rewarding but challenging. But anyway, guys, like right now I feel like I'm just putting myself in a worse situation by trying to take out that ballista quickly instead of just like waiting around it. Because I don't really see much point in funneling all my units down there. But regardless, I'll be back for some more next time. I'll see you guys then. See ya.